We'd have to find someone today. Today? Yeah. Forget it. Like I said, that's a bad idea. I mean, come on. Why? Even if, well, even if La Migra is dumb enough to buy it, like you say, put that up there. But you still need the guy, right? Yeah. Well, I mean, you still need this famous baboso citizen who's going to marry this girl. There's nobody stupid enough to do that. Check this out. Wait a minute. Wait a fucking minute here. You're not thinking that. Is that why you came over here? You're asking me to marry this right, Luca? Hermano, I know it's a lot to ask. A lot to ask? Somebody's <laughs> life is at stake, Yeah, okay? right, my life is at stake. What the hell is wrong with you? You got your brains all screwed up with all that political bullshit of yours? Look, if you just stop being so emotional for a minute, you'd see it's really not a big deal. Not that big a deal? You know, that's your problem. You've always been real bossy. Ever since we were little, you think you know what's best for everybody. You know what you are? You're a fucking control freak. Yeah, that's well, what you you've are. always been a big pendejo, so what? Hey, Tony, I'm Look, all I'm asking you to do is put your name on a piece of paper and save a girl's Get life. Out that's of here. all. You're, you're talking about marriage. I don't even know this girl. Who cares? Look, all you gotta do is put your name on a hey, piece of paper. Excuse me, and... have some respect here. Look, I'm not asking you to live with her. Do you mind? Or have babies or anything like that. Just go through the motions for me, Jimmy. Go through the motions? Go through the motions. You're talking about marriage, Carnala. That's marriage. That's out. Jesus, when did you become so bourgeois, huh? Hey, fuck you. And don't you ever call me bushwhacked again, cabrona. Whatever the fuck that means. Jimmy, all it is really is signing your name and saying I do. That's it. And if it saves... Hey. Listen to me. If it saves a girl's life, then why not? Hm? You and I know the system's for shit. We know that. So we use the system to fuck up the system. That's what I say. You're really starting to piss me off here, Carnala. You know, you always got a way of putting things. Es la pura shit. verdad. Who the hell are you to tell me what the fucking truth is, huh? Jimmy. I, I don't want to hear this, Tony. Come just on. Just listen to me for a minute, huh? Would you just relax, please? Hey, hey. OK. Look, this could be your way of getting back at all of them. Every cop, guard, judge, the whole system. You know, just. Just, just think about it. With this one little act, you could say fuck you to the whole establishment. If I was a man, I would do it. James Sanchez for Isabel Magana. James Sanchez for Isabel Magana. Yeah. James Sanchez. It says here I released her to the custody of James Sanchez. Your I-130? Do you have your I-130? Yeah, right, right, right. Take it out of the envelope, please. Señora Gloria. You the guy she's gonna marry? Yeah. She loves me, man. Really. She does. She really misses me too. I can feel it. Okay. Wait. Your eye too. Really, she's crazy about it. We're like this. Thanks. By the power vested in me by the state of California, I hereby pronounce you husband and wife. Could you please sign this? <laughs> Little brother, you are amazing. Thank you very much. So, uh, I guess I see you all in divorce court next week. Thank you. We'll see you next time, all right? Thank you. All right. Really appreciate it. Next time, all right? Yeah. We did it. We did it again. We did it again. Oh, you have no brothers left. It was a family emergency. 
puedo creer esto. Ya lo llamé, Irene and I came over from the Ole Cafe, and even Memo was there, all the way from Pinchi West Side. I don't know what we were all supposed to do. Shit! But then in our house, the difference between a family emergency and a family party wasn't that big, you know? What were you thinking of? Oh, you Jimmy. Hijo. Ven acá, hijo. A ver, explícame, ¿qué es lo que pasa aquí? Pues nada. Nada. This girl says that you're her husband. Hijo, is that true? Well, yeah, like technically speaking, but but hey, it's not like for real or nothing like that. Jimmy, did you marry her or did you not marry her? Yeah, I did, kind of. A chingao. Talk to her, okay? She can tell you everything. Ay, Dios. What is this, the Spanish Inquisition? Huh? Look, all we did was save a girl's life. And it wasn't easy. So maybe somebody should thank us? That's right, maybe somebody should thank us. Look, I got some shit I gotta do, okay? No, you got nothing to do. Nothing. Listen to me, both of you. You always know what's right for everybody with your porqueria política. But did anyone ask Isabel what she wanted? Hmm? What do you mean, what she wanted? Maybe we should have made some café con leche and invited the neighbors over to talk about it. Papa, we didn't have time to. Hija, you just messed up this girl's life without even asking her permission. Hmm? Oh. Well, they were going to deport her without asking her permission. And when she got off that plane, they were going to shoot her without asking her permission. So maybe we should have just left it alone and she would be dead. All nice and neat. That's the problem with life. It's just so messy. Does anybody want any taquitos? <laughs> you young people. You think no one has ever lived before you did. No one knows anything except you. Don't you think I know what it feels like to be picked up by La Migra and sent away? Without ever seeing my family? Without knowing what will happen? want to tell me something about survival? Well, let me tell you this. There are certain things in life that are sacred. Sagradas. And we don't spit on them, because without them, it doesn't matter if we live or die. Marriage is something we don't spit on. And Isabel believes that she is married. She thinks she's married to you. Yeah, well, check it out. I ain't married to nobody, see? Hey, you said those two little words. Hey, who asked you to butt in? Huh? And I didn't even bring a cake. ¿Y tú te callas? Uy, qué tachi. Jimmy, you signed a legal document. Yeah, so what? Te fregaste. So, the law believes that you're married too. Yeah, well, the law's pendejo, carnal. <laughs> that was a political action. I'm a goddamn revolutionary. <laughs> Look, you... You're the one that's gonna have to do all the explaining here, hermana. Because I told you, I'm never gonna see her again. I got some shit to do. It was late when Jimmy got home from all the shit he had to do. Isabel was probably the first person who didn't let Tony boss her around. No, no, no Friday! You can't 